Hey Veg Fam, it's your girl T here. I thought I'd come at you for another video. Um, because I'm home alone, it's actually quiet. The baby daddy's not here. The grandbaby's not here, so I thought I'd sit here and record a video. Um if you see me looking down, it's because I'm remote accessing my camera through my phone, so I'll keep looking down because eventually the screen's gonna cut off and I can't see myself. But um if I look a little pale, not not just the light exposure, but if I look pale, it's because I have been on a birth control pill. I haven't been on birth control since I had my daughter, which has been 20 plus years ago. Um, I'm on this new birth control pill to try to help regulate my period. So this is going to be a TMI kind of video. So guys, you don't want to watch this. But um, I've been on this new birth control pill and it has my body like really out of whack, out of sync, out of... <laughs> I don't know, it's it's crazy. So I may look a little pale or off a little bit, and that's why, other than that, I mean, I feel fine, I feel great, enjoying the peace and quiet. How are you all doing out there? Um, how has everybody been? It's been a while since I've, you know, came to talk to you all. Um, this video is kind of going to be like a shoot the shit random BS talking. Um, I am going to do another video and it's going to be a unboxing. I was on Amazon shopping like always. The baby daddy gets mad at me. Um, and I found some mason jar cups with the silicone sleeves to them. So I'm going to do an unboxing of those. I think they're really neat. They look so fun. Um, the grandbaby's going to love it because she thinks that all the Gmos cups are the cool cups. And I'm just thinking... <laughs> G-Moss cups with the spill cups. We give you the spill-proof cups so that you don't make a mess. But she loves carrying around my 20, I think it's 24 ounce maybe, um, Starbucks cup. It's almost as tall as her. Like, and that's how short she is. Poor thing is only 31 inches, um, 31 inches tall, but my Starbucks cup is like just about half her height. But she loves playing with it and taking it out the cup holder and carrying it around. I'm just thinking... I need you to put this down. This cup was expensive, but she loves playing with it. But these new ones, I, these new ones I have are mason jars, and they're really nice. Um, I kind of get tired of using plastic. I feel like plastic sometimes alters the taste of your drinks and stuff. And that glass is probably the better off alternative to go. Um, the only thing is I haven't tried these cups in my or any of the mason jars. Because I had a few here, but not, like, drinking to drink out of. Um, I haven't tried them in my cup holder in my car. But I do know that the, I think the bigger one doesn't fit in the baby daddy's van. So we had to use a smaller one. And it's like a, a snug just fit. But I think his van cup holders are a little small. Oh, excuse me for that. Um, But, yeah, so what's been going on? I have been really going through a rough time with these new birth control pills. They really, really got me just completely out of sync. And I hate to keep saying that, but they do. Um, in the comments below, let me know if you all have ever been on a birth control pill and how it did with you when you first started taking it, if you can remember then. I mean, some people don't remember and some people took theirs with no problem. Me, I am having a heck of a time with this one. I've called the doctor and told him what was going on, and he was kind of like, just ride it out, let's see what happens, you'll be back to see me in a couple weeks, you know, we'll see from there, and I'm just kind of like, I don't know if I got that much longer in me, because I feel like it's draining me of everything. Um, I still get up and go out, I still get up and do my normal routine, is working out. Um, I think it has caused some weight gain, but... I don't know because I'm not going to lie and say that I've actually been watching what I'm eating as to I have but I haven't like I haven't been going overboard with the junk which is what I love the most but I have been eating more than normal I was at my mom the other day and she was like girl you've been eating and I was like I know it's like I stay hungry It's like I stay hungry and I just want to eat, 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 and eat. And I don't know why. But I do believe that night, after eating, was 
We went to my daughter's house. I was eating their dinner too. I'm like, give me some of this. I want some of this. It was good. So the grandbaby ended up eating with me. No, I don't just go to my daughter's and eat her food. But that night, um, she had made some... What did she make? She made some green beans, hamburger, cheese, and... I don't know what it was. I don't know what the dish was called, but it was green beans, hamburger, and cheese. And, um... It was really good. I was like, wow. Oh, excuse me. Um, but, yeah, it was, it was good. The, like I said, the grandmother ate with me. But I had been eating all day. My mom was like, girl, you've been eating. But all I was saying was, later on that night, I got a sneeze. Um, later on that night, when I went to bed, I felt fine. Like, I felt like I satisfied myself eating. I pretty much slept really good that night. I slept all night, and it was the best sleep one could ever get. Um, I'm drinking. I wanted to try the new Mountain Dew from KFC. Um, I think it's mango something. I don't know. I'll insert what it is somewhere up in here. I think it's mango, and I don't think it's all that. I really don't. I don't know. I won't order it again, whatever it is. But, uh, anyway, I just wanted to get on here for a hot second and see what's going on. And say hello. It is nice to be back. I am sitting in the living room. As you see, the grandbabies. Cookie Monster! And Elmo. This is her, um, blanket. Her comforter. That she... <laughs> She carries around with her. We don't take it outside, but as far as in the house, she takes it with her from room to room. But um, we have to keep it in here because um, at, on my seat, I have a blanket that I keep to cover myself up when it's cold. And then that's her blanket that she gets and she'll come over and sit with me. <laughs> that's, it's so cute. Then when it's time to go to bed, she'll drag the blanket in the bedroom with her. And we'll put it in her baby bed. And then <laughs> she won't stay in her baby bed for long. And then, before we know it, she's over in our bed. And here comes the blanket. Her and the blanket over in the bed with us. And that's where she sleeps most of the night. But, um, at home she sleeps in her baby bed fine. But here, that girl will not sleep in that baby bed for nothing. Sorry about that. My phone is still on. Um, but here she, no. She'll sleep part of the night in the baby bed. And then she'll have to come and get in the bed with us. Or get in the bed with me. Normally she's here with me and her. She'll come and get in the bed with me. And then she'll sleep really good. Um, it's funny because I remember the nights her mama was little and her mama would <laughs> sleep in between me and her daddy. And I would have to wiggle myself out the bed really slow, like like just like slide out the bed so that I don't wake her up. And it's funny because sometimes I'll wake her up and I'll have to stand there and be real quiet because she'll, you know, turn just turn over and go back to sleep. But it's so funny. I was like, she reminds me so much of her mother. Um, but, yeah. Like I said, this is just a random blah blah TMI blah blah kind of video. Um, and it's nice to be back. I should be back um, doing more videos because I have more free time now. Um, I am currently charging my iPad. Excuse me. Um, when we travel, I never take my iPad with me, and I didn't know that when we packed it up this this last time we went to Pennsylvania, that I forgot to turn it off. So it was completely that it's only on two percent right now. <laughs> so yay to a dead iPad. So, but anyway, I am going to get off here, and this it was just a we'll call this a test video startup back, whatever you want to say. We'll see. But anyway, it's nice talking to y'all. You all have a great day. And remember, much love.